Besides improving the aesthetic of a space, plants invite the energy of nature into your home or office. In some fancy practices, people believe that plants are very important in creating a balanced and harmonious space. For example, good luck plants bring positivity into your life. In contrast, there are also bad luck plants that might cause havoc and challenges. In today's video, we are going to share some unlucky plants that you should avoid placing in your home. Number one. Dead or dying plant. Feng Shui believes that a plant that is dead or dying should be removed. This can help prevent negative energy from accumulating in a room. Number two, plants with spiky thorns or pointy leaves. In most cases, plants bring positive energy into your home, but no spiky and thorns ones, such as cacti, are exceptions. Cactus has sharp and spiky thorns that resemble poison arrows shooting into the surroundings or directed towards a person. Therefore, we should never place cactus in the living hall or bedroom. We do not want negative energy to disturb our rest or sleep. Number three, tamarind. As per the traditional Feng Shui practices, the tamarind plant. It's believed to bring negative energies to the home and illness to the family members. Also, the plant is often associated with the driving of evil spirits. Number four, bonsai. Bonsai stands for swarf plants. This is why this wonderful species should not be included in your interiors, as it indicates standard clear growth. Brings bad luck and interferes with the smooth pattern of life. Number five, hydrangea. According to Feng Shui, hydrangeas portray loneliness. Hence, it's advised not to grow this plant indoors. Although beautiful, it denotes cronies to heartfelt emotion and bad luck when grow inside the home. Number six, weeping fig. Weeping fig. Displays pretty white blooms and beautiful leaves that are excellent in removing dust particles in the room. But according to Feng Shui, this plant appeals to negative energy in the home, has avoided growing it indoors. Number seven, Euphorbia minia. Knowing the plant is a great outdoor specimen, growing it indoors can invite bad luck. It is also full of thorns and very toxic. So it might also harm your kids and pets. Number eight, fake and artificial plants. Having a few artificial plants to decorate your home is fine, but do not overdo it by overcrowding. A fake plant symbolizes attracting people with motives or evil intentions into your life. 